to meet our team. Yeah! All right, D, our distant cousins. All right, I'm going to introduce each cousin to you so you have a better idea of who they are. The cousin that your mom loves more than you. Ben! Make out with Trent! Yeah. 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 up to the reunion and you're like, he's related to us? <laughs> Gary! Yeah. And yeah. who is more like a sister to you than your actual sister, Nancy! Yeah. And the black sheep cousin, Nicole! Oh, earlier this evening you saw a multi-word story. Uh, these are advanced students. They can't just do regular multi-word stories. <laughs> you guys, right? They're advanced. They're the team. They're just cousins. Um, we are going to do a multi-word fairy tale. Oh, so, what are we going to meet? We're going to start off with a once upon a time. We're going to meet possibly an evil uh, uh, no. antagonist. Uh, maybe some magic. Maybe some love. Who knows? Um, what I need from the audience is the name of this made-up fairy tale. Bilbo's Adventure. Uh, what do you mean? Bilbo's what? Adventure. <laughs> dragon Scale. Bilbo's back A Dragon Scale! Wow. Thank you for that great suggestion. A Dragon Scale! Uh, this is the multi-word fairy tale! Once upon a time, long, long ago, in an enchanted cave, there lived a dragon who was very scaly. His name was... Darren. <laughs> Darren the scaly dragon soon began to notice that day after day he was losing more of his scales. He worried about all of the scales just falling off of him every day, every second, more scales falling off of him. And then suddenly, oh, he started to look for lotion because he goes, Damn, fucking lotion. And the lotion didn't help, and he ended up being butt naked and having not one scale on his oh. body. But he realized, being scaleless, many other women dragons would find him much more attractive. <laughs> so he wandered late at night and slithered his tail through the forest. And he found others. <laughs> Dragons and lizards that go, oh my god, you're so sexy without all those damn scales. And then suddenly the witch showed up from the enchanted forest and she saw Darren the scaleless dragon and decided, damn, you look ugly. So she waved her wand and all the scales began to once again grow onto his body. And man, he looked good and fine. So she wandered <laughs> through the forest because little did he know these new scales were so attractive and shy that other girls go, oh my god. And they were magical and it made him powerful and super attractive. Very super attractive. <laughs> <laughs> so he met this other girl with long scales and they, and they lived happily. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Gary on stage. Um, we are going to play a little game uh, called Dr. Seuss Therapy. Oh, Gary is, is a patient of uh, Bev's uh, therapist. Uh, and this is like a regular therapy scene, except they are going to be speaking in the uh, rhyming scheme of a Dr. Seuss. So Dr. Seuss, the author of such stories as Green Eggs and Ham. Uh, not cat and hot tin roof. What's the cat one? Cat and hot. Cat and hot. Cat and hot. Cat and hot. Um, and others. Um, <laughs> all right. So what we need from the audience is what is the unusual reason that Gary is seeking therapy today? Wedge his pants. What else? He shattered his stove. He grew a tail. Is there going to be multi He can only wear Great. camouflage. He's a bad uh, uh, He's got multiple personalities who are constantly chasing him. All right? So Gary's got some multiple personalities. Uh, Bev is going to be his doctor. Here we go. This is Dr. Shoot. There we go. Well, 
Jason McKinney. I'm glad you came in. I'm kind of thinking I might be related to your kin. <laughs> I look through your file, and it's mighty thick. But what I'm really wondering if you are a hit. <laughs> It's not a pick, but I've got these things following me. It's like in my mind, they keep following me everywhere. It's like I have this one thing, and then it's another thing, and then it's this person, and there's another person. It's like Ted, and it's like Fred, and it's like sometimes wish I was dead, because I don't want to be following around and people into my head. So what do I do? What do I do? Get rid of these people, and they're following me around and threatening my life. She got my life. <laughs> I think you've got some big problems, yes. And I just figured out I'm related to Aunt Beth. <laughs> I've got several things that I think you could try, but I think what I'm concerned about is that you might die. <laughs> are chasing you. You look so fraught. I'm so afraid one of you is going to get caught. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think if it's at best, she's not the best. She's been following me around since about 12, I guess. I don't know why Aunt Bess is after me. I think she should follow Uncle Pete. But she follows Uncle Pete, then she follows me. I got all these people following me, so what can I do to solve this problem and get you to give me some kind of solace? Ooh. <laughs> well, this is what I recommend. I think you can climb a tree or swing from a branch. You can talk to a neighbor and pull down a pan. <laughs> Go buy an orange, <laughs> or live on a farm beneath the scourge. <laughs> I'm okay with the neighbors not pulling down my pants. Yeah, I got something I gotta hide in these pants. So what I gotta do is find this scourge that you're talking about. I don't know where that scourge. So what can I do, like I said, to solve this problem with these people following around? I think they want to rob me. <laughs> I don't want to lose my perfectly good goods. So help me out, Doc. Could you? <laughs> Could you do that? I'll tell you. Time's a wasting. I ain't got no time for hasting. <laughs> and I'm getting sick of you and all the problems that come with one and two. <laughs> but you're my doctor. They sent me here. That's why I pay you this copay here. Don't you understand? <laughs> that you're part of my plan. It's a PPO. Don't you understand? <laughs> <laughs> That's your job. Tie in. <laughs> Called inanimate objects, uh, where each of them are going to take on the personality of an item within the category of things, such as uh, they may take on uh, things like art supplies, or or things you might find in a bathroom, or things you might find in a gardening shed. Um, what is the category of items that they are? All shoes. Or shoes. Kindergarten. Or products. Tops. Kitchen supplies. Tea tops. Vegetables. Shirts. Poetry. Vegetables. Cedar vegetables. We are. Potatoes. Potatoes. Okay, alright. We are going to do. They are vegetables. I don't know how much longer I'm even going to be here. She gives all the zucchini away. <laughs> well, I got maybe one more day left. Nobody wants lima beans. <laughs> I know what you mean. I'm a wilted eggplant. <laughs> no one eats me anymore. 
I don't think I feel I'm asparagus. I mean, I make everybody's pee stink. I'm super healthy, but mess up their urine. So I'm, just <laughs> I'm so lucky to be a cucumber because when I start to rot, they can just pickle me and it extends my life longer. Shave <laughs> <laughs> the shit of cucumber over there. And yeah, nobody can pickle a lion with me. Asparagus. They used to make. It black perm, but I guess that went out of style. It must have been on this shelf for six months. <laughs> Maybe if we're lucky, we'll be made into gratitude. Who knows? Maybe we'll be into like a health shake or something. Maybe I could like, you know, be like in like protein shake or something. Like we got these weights, you know, a little asparagus. And it's like, you can't put asparagus in a protein <laughs> shake. That's disgusting. Yeah, three months. Uh, maybe they can put a lima bean in a shake. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Who likes lima beans? Nobody. They should get the away too. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Back off lima beans. <laughs> <laughs> I'm heading for the great disposal. No, you're not. Don't listen to them. Oh, I know that. Oh, I'm so sick of you crying all the time. I'm sick of you. Shows up. Uh, which, for those of you who don't know, sounds a little like. As soon as that song starts, they are going to have to have the most intense eye contact that they have ever had in the prophecy until the song finishes. Alright, so. Uh, we've got uh, Nancy and Craig starting with Nicole making an entrance. Where in the high school are they? Cafeteria. Science lab. Hallway. Gym. Detention. Detention. Wow. detention. They're in the detention hall. Great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, detention hall. Uh, this is Dawson's Creek. Yeah. Here we are, Sissy. Our last day. In detention hall at Apple Valley High. <laughs> I can't believe, Jack, that you convinced me to smoke in the bathroom. Now we're in detention on our last day in high school. This is terrible. Oh, Sissy, it's not terrible. It's awesome. Look what's went ahead of us our whole life. It's just going to be so amazing. Well, but not. <laughs> 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 I think you're right, Jack. I think our world is full of possibilities after high school. Yeah. Well, I'm not so sure, Sissy, if I want to continue having a relationship with you after we graduate. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> 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 
What? <laughs> what? We have been together for six years since junior high. I know, sissy, but you know, it's a whole new adventure that's starting, and I want to be part of it. I want to feel it. I want to live it. Hey. I want to... Sissy Jack, why are you going to tell me where the tension was today? You know I'm going to get in trouble for this. It's like you did this on... <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> what do you mean, what is this? What is this? <laughs> You're my best friend. You know how I feel about Jack. We've been together for six years. <laughs> yes, and that's been the problem. So I wanted to try something new before we graduate. <laughs> 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 I thought you guys were just best friends. I didn't know you guys were hooking up. Well, what? You're my best friend. I. I'm so sorry, Alice. I didn't know that us hooking up was going to bother you so much. <laughs> Gosh, can't we just all get along and maybe. Such as uh, the word, what have we done in rehearsals? Uh, time. time or uh, match, match <laughs> or, or, or other words like that. What is a word that has multiple meanings? Is that you? Stare. 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 Read. Read. Oh, read. Help. Read. Help. Read. Yeah. Um, oh, right. We did, we did write. Did we do right? Yes, we did write. We did you write. Uh, let's go with. Wait, does Reed have multiple meanings? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. We pronounce it differently. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's say Reed. 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 All right. This is Commando. So, Jeff, are you going to take that Reed and just whip me? I <laughs> can't. <laughs> yeah, beat me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my read for my oboe is broken. Do you have a new one? No, I have a pocket. Just a sec. Here you go. Thanks. It's a pocket for you. Okay, kids, today we're going to read a story about a scaly dragon. Oh, is he going to lose all of his skills or keep any of them? Hey, Ed! Will he have access to lotion? <laughs> Wait, can you guys read this book? <laughs> Listen, bud, I can read you like an open book. You don't know anything about me, man. I know everything about you. Your eyes taking everything that belongs to me. Listen, little brother, it needs to stop. She can't find you. <laughs> I said this god awful read. I don't know why you even bothered. I don't either. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the cousin told me it was good. I'm going to sucks. <laughs> totally. I don't even want to touch it to throw it out. <laughs> Read this. Am I really being out of it? I can't believe this. I mean, am I supposed to pay taxes? 
It doesn't even make any sense. Uh, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm going to put a house on reading railroad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can't house railroad. I made this aim. Come on. This is the new monopoly. <laughs> Don't do it. Yes. I mean, it's public housing. Everyone needs to live there. So. <laughs> <laughs> Spent a lot of hours with us. Never complained. Um, but we <laughs> 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 